What's going on, Poke Cave? I just got back from my P.O. box, and I got a mystery box. We're going to open it up right now. So the other week, I got a Discord message from my video editor, Axie, and he said, Yo, Rev, I want to send you a mystery box. I said, Axie, you do not have to do that. That's way too kind. But he said, No, no, no. I need to send you this box, and I want you to open it up on the channel. He also wanted me to give everything away that I pull out of this mystery box to you guys here in the Polka Cave. If you'd like to enter the giveaway, all I have to do is, number one, smash the like button. Number two, subscribe to the channel. And number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section letting me know what the best Pokemon card is that you've ever pulled from a booster pack. All right, guys, so the moment of truth, I have no idea what's going to be in this mystery box, but I'm super excited, so let's find out. All right, we got our packing peanuts on top here, if you guys can see this. All right, so we're digging through here. We got a big package. It's, it's protected with bubble wrap and everything. I think it all might actually be in this box. All right, dude, so I know you do video editing and stuff like that, but you also are really good at shipping stuff because this was, like, super protected. So let's get this bubble wrap off here and see what we got. I see a note on the front there, too. So Battle Styles case here to keep everything protected. I'm excited to see what's in here. Okay, so open two and one last. And here's his Instagram as well if you guys want to give him a follow over there. Tell him thank you with the moment of truth. Let's see what we got in here. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, okay. Where do we even begin? So two and one open last. Got it. Okay. Okay, okay. Just briefly looking here, I do see what seems to be possibly a booster bag. It looks kind of old, maybe like from the black and white era. There's like a whole bunch of different stuff in here. I think we have even more than just Pokemon. Maybe I'll just start on the left side. Um, okay, so to get started off here, we do have a pack of energies. And um, there's probably just a whole bunch. Of, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to split this up for the giveaway winners. I'll probably do three different giveaway winners. Um, that's probably how I'm going to do it. But this might just be some um, energies to kind of keep everything like together in here. So let's see what we got in this box. Pokemon card game. Okay. Interesting. I'm not sure exactly what we have in this pack. But let's find out. So, okay, I see some damage counters, some dice and stuff like that. Let's see what's inside of this sort of like pack here. Or not pack, I guess it's like a protector for your cards. Ooh, okay, we got a Morpico to start it off here on the top. Let me see if I can get all these out. Okay, let's get it going. Starting off with a Morpico Sword Shield 012 Black Star Pro. That's actually a really cool card. And we're moving, oh, we're moving into Dragon Ball Super now. Just straight up right out of Pokemon. Um, Shield, let the battle begin. Okay, let's keep going, let's keep going. We got King Vegeta, Hidden Ambitions. This is really cool. So actually, I do have like a couple of Dragon Ball Super Booster boxes, um, but I never actually really opened up much. I only opened up a few packs of this, so this is really sick. All right, we're gonna keep moving, and okay, you know what? We have another, I think another TCG, perhaps. Um, I think this is a Japanese TCG. I'm actually not super familiar with it, but it looks pretty cool. It looks like these are kind of like full hollow patterns on here. So we're going to put that to the side as well. I like the Dragon Ball Super stuff a lot. Actually, let me know if you guys would want to see me open up some Dragon Ball Super on the channel. I know it's a little bit different. I know, like, some people might not like it. Some people might love it. But maybe I could do one video where I just open up a bunch of different TCGs all, like, in one video. All right, and then we have a few packs of energies here, I think, to just take up more space in that box. All right, so let's start over here. And nice, dude. We have a Vaporeon um sm12a that's a gorgeous artwork and oh karina's focused right on the back there yo that's sick dude you don't have to send this in um dude i really appreciate it actually i think i've only pulled this card maybe like once or twice uh really cool card i really love this vaporeon though i'm very curious what this pack is you're scaring me with this this is oh what a sampling pack of black and white Plasma Storm? Dude, that is sick. I've actually never opened up one of these before. Wow. So three cards are in this pack. There could be no calm before this storm. Dude, that's actually nuts because Plasma Storm is probably like one of the best uh, sets from the black and white era. All right, so I'll tell you guys what. I think maybe like towards the end of this video, I'll open this pack up. I don't know what is exactly in this pack before, but there's three cards in here and it looks really cool. So I'm going to set this to the side for now. We're going to keep going through here. So I'm going to keep going through here and seeing what else we got. It looks like... Okay, Pack Fresh Old School is what this one says. And there's a ton of cards in here. So let's check this out and see what we got. Let's do... Let's start like this and maybe flip them over as we go. Oh, Team Plasma Ball. Already started with some black and white air stuff, dude. That's nice. 
I love the Team Plasma cards. Alright, so I'm literally just gonna flip through each one and then s reveal it. Knit Arena, also another black and white era card. Really nice stuff. Black and white is definitely one of those sets like in the middle that are vintage but still kind of um, able to be kind of picked up here and there. Bill Tank, another really nice one. Ooh, we got another, just they keep piling up. Dude, this is awesome. Even like non hollows from black and white is really cool. Ooh, and then we got another, yeah, 2013, still in the black and white era. Vanillaite, nice. Let's keep going, man. It's getting, a, it's got like the winter theme on these cards. Starting to get a little chilly out. Mankey and the apples are officially frozen. I pulled this card before, definitely. That's a really cool one. And we got a Nidoran, nice. Okay, I'm actually just going to flip it over. It might be a little bit easier that way, but um, we do have another one of those cards from that other TCG here. And I'm not sure if this one's like a super special one or not, but it says incredible power. And let's just kind of go through it this way now. <laughs> like, <laughs> I was doing it backwards for some reason. I don't know if I should have been doing it like that, but we got an Electabuzz, nice. Uh, 2010, oh, dude, Heart Gold Soul Silver? Dude, you're spoiling us. That's way too kind. Thank you, dude. Oh, I love Arkansas Soul Silver stuff. Let's go. Hitmon lead, Hitmon Chan. That's actually really sick. Black Belt. Nidorino. 2010 Harkle Soul Silver. We got a Q bone as well to get that really cool sort of like vintage style borders on the sides of these. Magnemite, dude. Great artworks. Harkle Soul Silver. There's the Dratini. I love this card. It's like a baby Dratini. We got a Voltorb. Moving into a Pidgey. Even the Pidgeys look cool from this era. Another Voltorb. We got a Diglett. All right. I think there's a divider coming up here. We got another Magnemite. Magby! We got Magby the baby. Whalmer, always smiling. And... Okay, now we have a little divider, so maybe we're switching sets. Let's see what happens. Moving into... Dude! No way! No way! Yo, we got an EX Era card. Wow, Magby again, but this time from the EX era. All right, let's keep going. We got a Tentacool as well. Ooh, a Trap Inch. Chin Chow. And even like the cards, like the non hollows and stuff from super old school stuff like this. Pack Fresh is absolutely amazing. Dude, thank you so much. Centret. Nuzleaf. Ooh, moving into a Tentacruel. And then we have another divider. I think we're going to move into the black and white era from which I was doing a little bit earlier. Yeah. So Golduck, black and white era. We have, let me keep this organized. We have a Great Ball. We got Electrode. Farfetched. We got a Snivy. A Pokeball. Spoink. These are all really cool artworks from all different generations. So it's cool to see stuff like this. Electabuzz. There's this. <laughs> I love this Psyduck. <laughs> Psyduck. Cacturn. All right. So we're going to keep moving on and... It looks like we have another stack of cards. These are also pack fresh as well. So let's see what we got in this one. I see some, I think I see a little Yu-Gi-Oh in here too. Ooh, these ones are all in um, top loaders. So let's see what's on the front. All right, so we got, um, it looks like another one from the TCG that we were looking at a little bit earlier that we saw in a couple other ones. Again, I'm not 100% sure what this one is, but um, they have some cool artworks for sure. Moving into Hitmonlee though from Fossil, nice. Dang, I, that's crazy. Oh, we got some reverse action going on, too. Also from, I believe, the black and white era, I want to say. I think. Yeah, I think so. Ooh, some really cool artworks. Junk arm as well. Nice. I think these are all sort of like reverses, mostly. And we got an Oddish. Oh, dude, nice. Oddish sleeping on the job. Okay. All right, so we're still getting there. Remember, he said to save two and one for last. They look like cards that are in card savers, so I'm very curious, but we're going to wait till the end for those as well as this Plasma Storm sampling pack that we will open up. So let's see uh, what we have in here. Okay, I do see some Yu-Gi-Oh! There might there's something else behind there too that looks kind of interesting. Oh, okay, some more Dragon Ball Super. Let's see what we got. Dude, wait, Son Goku, I think. See, I don't know the different rarities and stuff like that, but I can tell you the artwork looks really cool on this one. Ooh, Barry Magician Girl. Let's go, dude. Nice. First edition. That's sick. Yo. See, I don't know, dude. This looks pretty sick. I kind of want to look at the artwork um, out of the top loader. Dang, that's really cool. I'm actually going to take it out of this and be really gentle because I want to see, like, the full... Um effects of this card dude that is too sick that's crazy cool wow the texture on this is crazy 
All right, that is pretty sick, but let's see what this last card is here in that pack. It's a Yu-Gi-Oh card, so what do we got? Ooh, Apple Magician Girl. Let's go. First edition. That's pretty sick, too. I like the selection, dude. Really cool. I wasn't expecting all these different TCGs out of here, honestly. You're kind of getting me, like, more intrigued to kind of do some more different openings here in the cave. Ooh, okay. Let's see what we got here. It looks like we do have some tops cards. Let's see what we got. Let's see. We got something else on the front there. Let's go through and start maybe. Yeah, let's start this way. So another one of these cards. Um, again, I'm not 100% sure. But I do know what these are. These are tops cards, and I love looking at these. So these are different scenes from uh, Pokemon the Movie 2000. Could it get worse? Three treasures. And then if you look at the back... Um, you can see like more information about it and everything like that. If you guys don't know, the Tops cards came out, I think like 99 and 2000 was when they were around during the early Wizards of the Coast era. So there's some cool cards here. I used to collect these as a kid a little bit. The lovely melody. Okay, cool. Okay, so we're, we're almost there. We got, uh, number three next. Let's see what this one is. Pack fresh as well, dude. Again, spoiling us. Spoiling us. Let's see what we get out of this one. I'll probably... Oh, wow. It's just getting crazier and crazier as we go here. Uh, so it looks like we do have some fossil cards. We got Recycle. We got Horsey. Geodude. We got Slowpoke. Psyduck again. Uh, does Psyduck just have the best card artworks or something? Like, they're all really, they're really good. Tentacool. There's just like a lot of emotion in them. Um, and a lot, a lot going on. Energy search. We got a sand slash uncommon. Moving into a cloister. Then a ghastly. Ooh, nice. Okay. Yeah, it's progressively getting crazier, and uh, I can't wait to see what's in here. I'm like, very, I'm very curious what the sample cards would be in here, or if they're the same three that you would get out of every pack, or if it can vary. I really don't know. I haven't really messed around with any sort of like sample cards or packs very much at all. But here we go. Okay, we have number two so we're opening these two last so this will be second to last i do see some dragon ball super i think i see a pokemon card on the front oh oh dude i think i just saw something no way hold up oh no way he did not have to send that over dude thank you so much this is getting crazier as we go the dark Rye and cresselia legend card dude you're a legend for sending that over Oh my god. Legend cards are the best from the Heart Gold Soul Silver era. Dude, thank you so much. And again, these are all going out to you guys. I'm going to have, I'll probably do like three winners. Um, and I'll just kind of like combine different things together. So make sure you enter the giveaway. Again, make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And then leave a comment down below. Let me know what your favorite card is that you pulled out of any pack ever. Make sure you check out Axie, the legend, for sending this over. Oh, we got a Japanese tag team card. Let's go. Dang. Okay. I'm really, I'm really feeling these. We, with some of these, we are getting in English now, which is really cool to see. Um, but, yeah, there's some really good Japanese tag team cards. Oh, man. Typhlosion. Yo, come on. That's too... That is too good. That is too good. The Typhlosion Prime card. More Harkle Till Silver action. You hit me You hit me right in the sweet spot. That is... Harkle Till Silver era is just... It's just... It's just too good. With that Gen 2 Typhlosion, dude. Oh my god, that's awesome. I think we got one more in this pack, and then there's another one? It's just, like, is it going to get crazier? Woo! King Piccolo, Dimensional Conqueror. Is this... This looks pretty crazy. This is definitely looks like a crazy full art from Dragon Ball Super, right? Yeah. You're really making me want to open some of this Dragon Ball Super stuff that I have. I've held on to it um, and kept most of it sealed, but... You make me want to open up a box. That's pretty sick. And yeah, actually, this is a really cool hack for those of you guys that don't know. You can actually put these little, like, I guess you call them, like, post-it note type things on your card if you want to send it in to get graded. So it actually makes it easier for the grader to just kind of pull it out of there. Um, so less likely to damage the card. But I'm going to leave that in there. All right, last one. Then we're going to open up this sampling pack. Let's see what we have. I kind of scared here. We, yep, we're going to put that to the side. This is, the, this is what he said to open up last. Number one. Wait, is that it? Oh, man. Dude. 
Blue eyes, white dragon. Let's go. DB1? Oh my god, that is too sick. Dang, okay, okay. I actually do have some Dark Beginnings booster boxes that I never opened up. So I was trying to remember what it was from, but yeah, that definitely rings a bell now. Okay, that's actually sick. But there's something behind it. And I see the words char. So I'm kind of scared. Okay. Okay, let's see what let's see what's behind it. It's red. It's red. It's red. Oh, come on, man. You did not have to do that. Yo. The blue eyes white dragon and the Charizard Hollow from Evolutions back to back in that last pack. Dude, come on. No, 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 dude. Come on. Guys, make sure you thank Axie for this. That was absolutely insane. But hold up. It's not over just yet. I want to see what's in this Plasma Storm sampling pack. I don't know if I should keep this thing sealed or not, but I'm just going to open it up. Um, and I, I, we can see what the sample cards are in here. Wow, dude. Let's go. All right, and we're saving this Plasma Storm pack for last year. This is a sampling pack, so I don't know exactly if you get, like, if there's a certain three cards that you get out of all of these or if it's, like, just random three cards. But we're going to find out right now, so let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Plasma Storm. One of the greatest black and white era sets, in my opinion. I'd say it's definitely a top three. Um, definitely up there for me is also Legendary Treasures. So 2012 Pokemon. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, what is in here? These open up kind of weirdly. But hey, I think that's how it's supposed to be, definitely. Yeah. Okay, and let's see what we got. So Wisdom is definitely on the front. And we have... So this isn't a code card. This is actually... It looks like a little like information about the set. Oh yeah, it opens up all the way like this. So uh, it's all it's a complete set list on here. I don't know if you could pull anything crazy from the sampling packs or not, but now this is when they had the uh, okay different games on here. Go to Pokemon.com. They also have the Pokemon trading card game. It's now available to play online. And those are all the different pack artworks. Okay, so let's see. I have no idea if there's a pack trick. If these are all the same cards, let's find out. Though we got a Wizmer. We got a coughing. Okay, nice. And, and. Oh, and we got a fungus. So three common cards. I guess, I don't know if they're all supposed to be the same or different, but that was pretty cool. Um, Dude, again, thank you so much, Axie. This is actually insane. The two dragons out of that last thing. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you do enter that giveaway to see if you can be one of three lucky winners for some of these items that you saw here today, courtesy of Axie. But that is going to do it. Hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you on the next one.